What is up, guys? It is Q here, approximately, like, two minutes after the last recording. Uh, here to explore the mine, because I really want to explore this mine right fucking now. So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, let's pick up the bedroll. And let's go ahead and light one of these flares. And let's explore this place. So we got some scrap metal here, which I'm not too worried about. Uh, we can get scrap metal pretty easily. Wood matches, sewing kit. I see a fire striker, I think, right there? Some accelerant. Oh, no, an emergency stem. That's helpful. Water bottle. Um, wow, not even going to say hello. Okay. Alexis just walked right past me and right past the microphone. Didn't even say hi to me or you guys. So I guess she hates us all. So let's go into this mine, yeah. Um, left is always right, but we'll go right this time. Because I think left takes us actually out of the region. Oh, I thought that was just a full first aid kit. And I was going to be like, wow, I've never picked up one of those before. Oh, nice. Those will come in handy. Plenty of revolver cartridges. Jerry can. A marine flare. Always helpful. Um, the jerry can is handy because it holds a bunch of fuel for our lantern. Okay, let's see if we got anything in here. Wow, this. another whetstone. Okay. Holy chocolate bar. Tasty. Okay, let's see what's down here. Oh my god, okay. Uh, we'll stay right this time. That is a... Storm Lantern with a little bit of fuel in it. And a dead body. New running shoes. Those look like work boots to me. That that's that's a rough way to go out though. Um a lot of coal in here, which is to be expected. It is a coal mine. I would pick it up, but we don't need to right now. Don't like the music that's happening. really don't like the music that's happening. That was creepy. We got a workbench in here. Give me gun. Or nothing. A hunting knife in 80% condition. Oops. That's not what I wanted. That, like... Okay. Okay. I mean, I might as well carry the second knife just because... Soda! Beef jerky and a newsprint. We'll go right again. Oh, hey, I've been in here before. some revolver cartridges over there. And I've managed to cheese this before... Damn it. Okay. I know you can cheese it, because I've cheesed that once before. You just kind of gotta, like, hop up here. Get up on top of this guy. And then you can hop onto this. Yeah, there we go. And you are rewarded with quality tools, rifle ammo, and a metal container with horn t-shirt, decent driving gloves, and marine flare. Our 
flares almost out, unfortunately. Yeah, I cheesed it, but you don't have to, because you can still get in here even if you don't cheese it, which is... Yeah. Well, this flare is about to run out. We're gonna use this lantern, because we have plenty of fuel. Thanks to the jerry can. Alright, so... We've made it to an exit, which I believe out there is... Uh... I don't remember, I don't know what region this is. Is this... Uh... I don't think this is Crumbling Highway. I'm pretty sure this should be, uh, the place between Coastal Highway and Timberwolf Mountain. Um, I'm forgetting the name. I'm terrible at this. <sighs> Pleasant Valley. Is this the region I think it is? I do believe so. Yeah, this is Pleasant Valley. Okay, so this is the place, if I'm correct. Yep, so this is the place that we'll need to go through to get to Timberwolf Mountain. And there's a town with a good amount of loot down there. And so when we finally go to Timberwolf Mountain, we will go to the town... And then we will loot it, and then we will head up to Timberwolf Mountain. But we're going to want to keep... Uh... We're going to want to keep wood on us to make fire, because I died heading up to Timberwolf Mountain last time there. So I'm hoping that won't die this next time heading up there, so. Alright, so we've explored that place. We know how to get there. Um, there's a frozen corpse here that has a 100% torch. Well, that... Okay, that was weird. We'll use a match. I would use the lantern, but I would much rather use this torch. Purely because it means I don't have to waste lantern fuel. Alright, so let's go this way. Is the dead body here? No. Okay, that's... Bizarre. Alright, so... Oh, wait. Okay, I searched all those already. Let's continue... And let's backtrack a little bit and explore the places we haven't explored. So... We should be coming up on a right turn here? Yep, okay, we didn't go this way. Oh my god! Okay, thank you, game, for scaring the piss out of me. I appreciate it. Oh no, we have been here. What? Is this the entrance? I'm... a little confused. That's a collapse. Just here. Okay. Um. Okay, that's the frozen body. Alright, okay, okay. I think I have my bearings. 
So we want to go this way. And then we want to hang this way. Um, I, we did not go this way, I do believe. Or did we just go this way? Yeah, no, we just came from this way. Yep, 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 okay. This place is far less explorative than I expected. Turns out it just kind of winds around itself a lot. Still nighttime. this point we have actually made it to the mine and explored it and I was hoping to get a revolver there um because that's where I got one last time but we did not have the good fortune of getting a revolver so that's kind of rough we, we still don't have any weapon to defend ourselves with we have the stuff to make a bow. Um, we don't have the stuff to make arrows. Um, we've got ammo. We don't have guns. Can can they shoot the bullet from bow? All right. I think right now what we should do is just get out of here for now. Um, because we are kind of running a little bit low on supplies. We have some water, which we'll drink. I'll eat these sardines. And I'll eat this chocolate bar. Yeah, we're running kind of low on supplies. Not horrendously low, but low enough to where... Um... I'm not 100% con comfortable to continue any further around, particularly. We could very easily go to Pleasant Valley, because the town has a ton of supplies. It would just be a matter of getting down there, but I don't particularly want to get down there. I didn't do that quite yet, because when I go to Pleasant Valley, I want the plan to be get to Pleasant Valley. I'll probably, when we decide to go to Timberwolf Mountain, it'll probably be like a two-episode thing, just getting there. I will probably get to Pleasant Valley uh, off-camera. And then I will do a recording. We will explore Pleasant Valley a little bit, gear up, get supplies, etc., etc. And then... Uh, that's not what I wanted. I'm fucking retarded. And then... Okay. We'll drop our old one then. And then we will get prepared. Um, get the wooden stuff we'll want. And the next video we'll be setting out to Timberwolf Mountain. Because it's a pretty treacherous pass just to get there. And then I think... Because my plan is to get to Timberwolf Mountain, make it all the way up to the tip of the mountain, get the parka, and come back. And I think Timberwolf Mountain, I'll probably make, like, a big old mega episode. Like, it'll be one, one fell swoop. Oh my god, I thought that rock, like, out of the corner of my eye when I wasn't paying attention, it looked like the outline of a wolf. And I nearly shat myself, I'm not gonna lie. That, that was a little bit of a... A little bit of a butthole clench right there. But yeah, you can go up that way too. Like, this place is far more extensive than I even I explored. I probably only explored, like... I don't know, I, I would say less than half of this place I properly explored. Is this the log sort? 
Yeah, okay, we're at the log sort. Uh, I thought we were... Yeah, I thought... Yeah, I thought we were all the way over here, but... Now that I think about it, that wouldn't have made sense, so... Okay, well, we're not very far from home, then. Um, which is kind of unfortunate, because I thought... Um, where I went, we might have popped out over that way, but... Because then I would have been able to grab that mountaineering rope. And at that point, I probably would have just gone back up to the fire tower and dropped the mountaineering rope. But... Since we are not, we are just going to head home. Um... Oh, this wind is totally going to put out this torch in it, isn't it? Yeah, this torch is going to go out. Maybe not. Maybe the gods have thrown us a bone and this torch will actually last the whole time. Also, I find it kind of weird that that dead body just had a 100% torch next to it, like, so that means dude managed to make a torch. Like, a perfect torch. He managed to, like, put the cloth on it, you know, soak it in whatever, whatnot, you know, that you need to do to make, like, a proper torch. And then was just like, you know what? I'ma not light this. And then just, bleh, fucking died. So... What a, what a fucking survivalist, you know? He, he, he's like someone with a lot of book smarts that has no street smarts. They know what to do, but not how to do it. <laughs> he's like, ah, yes, I have to make a torch and then light it and then this, that, and the other, and I'll be fine. And then he makes the torch and he's like, wait a second, I have no life experience. Poor guy, poor... Poor bastard. We're almost home. I'm hoping we'll be able to get there before... Before we get, like, a sprain or something. Like, we're at a sprain wrist... Sprain wrist? Sprain wrist right now, but... Uh... We're not on sloped terrain, so we should be perfectly fine. Our coastal town site. Sweet. It'd be nice if they added like more buildables to this, like be able to make like a uh, a simple fence with like scrap metal. Let's see what we got going on here. Is this full? Yeah, it's pretty much full. cardboard matches the accelerant um, now what we need to do is oh sweet some more cured stuff drop those guys pick that up pick that up um, do I keep 
tools in this one? It would appear so. Oh, I already have an arrow shaft. A singular arrow shaft. How handy. Okay, so now we can throw that in there. Throw the knife. A marine flare. Quality tools. The rifle ammo. The revolver ammo. Two whetstones. Another rifle cleaning kit. Um, I guess I'll keep the jerry can on us. Okay, and then we'll throw the cans in here. No. Yeah, we'll throw the cans in here. And then we'll call this good. I expected that mine to be a lot more explorative, but clearly it wasn't. So, yeah. Um, I guess thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, uh, go ahead, drop a like. If you're new and you want to see more content like this, go ahead and hit the subscribe. And if you want to support me doing this more than just in my spare time, there is a Patreon link down below. If you don't want to take a look, totally understand. And I will see you guys all next time. I hope you have a wonderful day. And yeah, see you next time on The Long Dark.